Okay, this uh, tape is on, or this video is on removing arterial plaque. We're, the problem is we need to save some people's lives. There's a way to do it, and it's just not being done. Example, there was a nurse who gave me an example of a young man who had come in to the hospital. This is supposed to be a, sh a shoulder and a guy's arm. It's not a very good rendering, but it, it's close enough. Had a clog in an artery in her vein or whatever. So what they did was, um, his elbow is actually about right there. They gave him a shot. And what this did was, in her own words, it, it just cleared the clog right out. This clog in here is supposed to be something that resembles a plunger. Oh uh, yeah, I guess something like that, the plunger. Um, terrible rending of a needle. Or a, a syringe, but the syringe going in, give an injection, and what that did was, when I gave him the injection, it just cleared the clog right out of there. Now, taking that same idea, if we can um, dilute this down, because what I was told was this injection was dangerous for anybody who was um, advanced in years because their body wouldn't be able to take whatever it was the injection was. If, but we, if we can dilute this solution that they used, whatever it was, that broke up this clog in the artery and vein, dilute it down and give it over a series of injections over a period of time, we might be able to save people's lives who have a uh, buildup in their arteries and veins, especially over here where the heart is. You've got veins and arteries leading into the heart, so here's the heart. You got uh, what happens is um, it's built up, gets built up, and eventually um, to the point at some point to where it's just like totally all the way across the vein or artery, and it plugs up. And then even though there might be still a little bit of flow, what happens is it slowly builds up and builds up and builds up. So actually, it's, it's along the whole a pretty good length of it is what it does. And the hole gets smaller and smaller and smaller, but the plaque just lines the whole length of it. So once you got this very small area, and it's almost like a very small uh, canal where a rock just kind of comes here and here and boom, lodges right there and blocks the flow totally because there was such a small area for it to go through to begin with that you get this little bitty clog right here, or a little bit of something that kind of gets stuck in there one, at one moment, and boom, heart attack. Well, what they have nowadays is they have, um, you can take somebody's leg and run something up into their body all the way up into here. I believe it's called angioplasty. And I need those who are nurses and doctors who actually know what I'm talking about. They, they know what this is. They run that up in there, and they can take a small balloon pushing this little tube up in here, and at the end of it, this, wherever it is, it's a small balloon, and inside the tube, I guess, is this, this apparatus that comes out, and there's a, a balloon that inflates, and then they move it back and forth and spread out this clog along the uh, artery to kind of open up a little area right in here so the blood can flow again. The problem is we still have this buildup along the sides of the walls that can just build back up again. If we can run something up in there to flatten out or, or level out the plaque in the artery, can't we just, here's a, here's a solution, can we not just, in a, either in addition to this or um, a totally separate idea from either the injections, just doing all the injections, uh, we can just go ahead and run something in the, up in there that since we're running in the vein of the leg all the way up to where the heart is, something anyway, to flatten out or level out the plaque, why don't we just go ahead and remove that? Here's what I want you guys to help me with. We need to save some lives. This is an idea. It can save lives. Our grandparents, our father, mother, sister, brother, uh, children could possibly be saved if we could develop this idea and make it work. You run something, you're probably going to run something up in through their, the vein or artery in their leg all the way to where the heart is and have it level out the plaque, why not just go ahead and have it vacuum out the plaque altogether so there's nothing there to, for anything else to build up upon?
why why leave it in there when we're in there anyway and we could possibly with a very very small suction tube um, vacuum it all out so that's my question I want um, please I mean what evil is there in this idea or any of my ideas when I'm trying to make um, life better for all of us this could save the life we save might very well be our own I mean I'm, I'm getting you know older everybody's getting older eventually we might get to a point where we have this blockage and if we're able to uh, use these ideas somehow or another so that either the injections um, or running the t again the proverbial tube up in there to vacuum out the plaque and we get these nice clean arteries again and you know promoting uh, blood flow promotes health Increase, I should say, increased blood flow promotes health and well-being, and the heart works less hard. So you, your overall health plus, you know, the the cardiovascular, everything. You know, the doctors know how to explain this better. But those who understand this, you know what I'm talking about. You know, this should be the side of the person. I don't know how, you know, exactly how things are supposed to go. But you get the idea. We run something in up to the body in the leg, all the way up in here, vacuum out the plaque, or we can use the injections so that when there's buildup in the arteries before this does become a clog here or here we start these injections with this diluted solution that'll take away layers of plaque layers of plaque at a time now, sorry, sorry that's what I forgot to say earlier was these injections over a series of uh, a, a series of injections over time a diluted version of whatever it was that ate that clog on that young man that that nurse told me about we dilute that solution so it's safe for any any age person and we give little bitty doses so that it eats away layers of plaque as it goes through the bloodstream. And a series of injections like that eventually, hopefully, where it's built up or where there's actually even a clog, hopefully it will remove that buildup. And again, giving us nice clean arteries and veins again, promoting better health, at least, you know, keeping it from getting worse, possibly if nothing else, to start with the maintenance and then later on and eventually maybe to actually eat away the whole thing layers at a time. So please help me if you know how to do this, you know somebody who can, um, let them know about this. This is a viable option. I got it straight from a nurse who has done this, given an injection that cleared a clog in a young man. Please, let's use this, dilute it down, give a series of injections to our, to our family members who may be a, a little bit older than us and have these um, congestion in, in their arteries and, and veins that can slowly remove layers and give them better health. We want better health for our loved ones. Let's do this. Thank you.